Say hi to my channel. Hey vlog. Say hey vlog. Hey guys, welcome to my channel and thank you. I want to say hi. Okay, say hi. Hey guys, welcome to my channel and thank you so much for being here. Welcome to, I think this will be a spend the day with me or maybe spend two days, we'll see. Hmm? Or spend two days. Um, the last I got vlog, makeup! The last time you guys would have seen me, uh, would have seen the vlog. Let me say I got some. Okay. I got some makeup. You got makeup? Yeah. Where? Look here, Mama. Oh, okay. I guess I like that. Um, the last time you guys saw, we were in Joburg preparing for Mother's Day stuff. Uh, we are now at the airport. We're at the slow lounge, FNB slow lounge, and we are ready to go home. Here's your dad. Should I talk to your dad? I'm leaving. Hey, here's, here's daddy. Good guys. Sorry about that. Um, we are at the slow lounge. We decided to we decided to leave my car because I need to come back to Joburg again soon. Speaking of coming back to Joburg soon, I'm gonna read you guys a comment. I don't know if you can hear me properly. I'm gonna read you a comment. This person used among man, I see. I think you should come back to Joburg, my love. This open up is too much. I think your friend is starting to get bored now. Visiting with the baby all the time at people's houses is not always cool. Guys, I don't know what kind of friends you have, no? but my friends don't have an issue with me coming with my child or my children. I know that for sure. Um, with that being said, I'm coming back to Joburg. <laughs> I'll probably come back alone. Did this lady get my order? Um, but I'll probably come back alone when I come back. But I'll be back in Joburg, so I decided to buy. Let me just leave my car because Milan and I had driven, so we're going to fly back. So we're at the slow lunch now. We're gonna board in about 30 minutes. Um, I ordered a glass of champagne and we don't go through and we are boarding soon. Um, anyway, I will see you guys in Durban. <laughs> I wish I had the same delusion that I do when I was two and didn't think that I could ruin anything at all. I could never fall. I wish I had that same conviction. Convinced I never need a fixing. Yeah, that girl really knew her business. Where did she go? Yeah, she thought she could do anything, thought she could get anywhere. Confident she's number one. And if not, then everybody's wrong Used to be calm, now I can't remember How I used to do it, that I was a member Of Confidence Club, cause that don't last forever I wish I saw what she saw I wish I knew what she knew I love how she just owned it But sadly I've grown it I know I'm still that girl But I don't know how to show it Like she knew like she knew, she knew, she knew Wasn't really ready, no, I had to grow Up but it's so heavy and I'm feeling low I'm learning all that was wrong for me And I wish somebody would've issued a warning No, they did, but I kept ignoring Didn't wanna have to face it But if I don't, I know it's gonna break me, oh Yeah, she thought she could do anything Thought she could get anywhere She's number one And if not, then everybody's wrong Used to be calm, now I can't remember How I used to do it that I was a member Of confidence love, cause that don't last forever I wish I saw what she saw I wish I knew what she knew I love how she just stoned But sadly I've grown it I know I'm still that girl But I don't know how to show
jag kollar dig hela tiden. Hej, hej. Nu ska jag zooma in dig lite så att jag kommer närmare dig. Då kan du säga hej mamma. Hej mamma. Eh, hej pappa. Hej pappa. Guys, we are home, and remember I told you that I'm renovating the back room. I want to show you. We started like putting tiles. Unjanpet, ngawa zukbugala. Ngengen zofunukbugansh. AJ, stop. We started with putting tiles in this room. Anyway, so the plan was to obviously like just finish these line and put a sliding door, but it's gonna take longer. So I just asked because before I can't even remember it was like cement. So I just asked if they can just put, put tiles, and I can move to my office soon. It's dark here. Um, Where was the house? I can move my office soon. God, I guess I, I'm still working. Okay, I just need to work quickly, and I will see you guys. I don't know if I'll see you today. I'll see you guys a bit. You guys haven't seen a London this vlog in a while. Um, so I need to take this off. I didn't do this week. I'll see you guys when Alanda gets here. She's still at school. I'll see you guys when I'll see you later. You know guys, one thing I actually appreciate about living at home is the fact that even after school, I still have, because it's 4 o'clock now, but I actually knock off at like five but like i sometimes push it to half past four but i like but once i once the kids yeah but when i was still living with the kids in Joburg, it was fun but i'd leave the house at half past four to go fetch uh, uh to go fetch the kids and once we get home i'm unable to work um because now the kids are here and i have to cook now i have to take care of the kids and even if i don't have to cook or whatever just uh, the noise you know and having to to, to 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 tend to them and one thing i do appreciate about being home is that after school i still can continue to work one month it's half past four. oh it's four o'clock why did i think it was half past four it's about well, half past four it's four o'clock at half past four i'm gonna knock off but between now and then the kids are here i would have done so much work um i know i always complain about being home but um oh, but there are like some cons 
of being home and this is one of them that I appreciate and another thing oh my god I what when I made the decision to move home I started watching um, this lovely girl her name is Palisa um, OG Polly yeah she goes by OG Polly on on, on on YouTube I started watching her because I remember her I think last year two years ago she renovated her back room into and making it her like woman cave and I started watching her because she she was very like specific like even like amounts that she was spending the time it took her and I remember watching her and she said it took her about almost a year like eight months for her to finish the the, the back room and it looked beautiful at the end and I'd be like every time she'd post I'd be like yo the costing and like it keeps just getting higher and higher and I'm seeing it so, like in the beginning when I moved I was like no so if I was lighting door now I'm just like okay cool I, small 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 step by step so the guy came give a fuck out the tiles um, now my mama said that we're just going to probably just instead of the sliding door let's just add another window so that we have like circulating air or whatever and I was just like okay cool at least and I'm hoping to move in by my end who is it? Oh okay um Yes, so my mom suggested we just add another window. I don't know if it's cheaper, but like, you know, at the end of the day, it's her house. Um, the sliding door would have been great, but the sliding door still would have required another window this side, you know, because the sliding door would have been here and it still, we still would have required it anyway. Um, so we're going to do that and I'm hoping to move in by month end, like move in. It's the 16th of April today. I'm hoping to move in by month end. Um, I need to call the Wi-Fi people to come extend and um, yeah yeah I need to call the Wi-Fi people to come extend and then I should be able to like pack up my whole office because currently you know this is the same desk I had at my old apartment um, same same setup that I had but I actually want to leave this in the main house for Alwande she's so gonna put it in her room and then I want to like buy new furniture like just buy a new desk and a new chair um, just make it like a proper proper office I even want like the cupboards Fuyo was a big big dreamer that's me right now um, started. yes so that's me right now and yeah, I just thought I'd come just like talk about that a little bit tomorrow. Hopefully, tomorrow I've got a busy work day. On Thursday, I'm going to shoot a sit down. I don't know when you guys are gonna watch this. Maybe I should put this up for Sunday. Okay, I'll see. I'll see. So I don't know. I don't want it to be confusion between my sit down and this because I'm not sure when I'm going to post this. I should post tomorrow's Wednesday. I should post this by Thursday. Yeah. Or even tomorrow. We'll see how the day goes. But it will be a short vlog, maybe 20 minutes. It's you know better than nothing. Let us get back to work. I'm so sad too. Let me just go make coffee actually. Because I'm hungry. But my dad went out to go buy me food. That's another thing I love about being home. Just a kaya, like kaya, I think I've realized to see everyone's love language is acts of service. My mom just came in now to come offer me corn. Um, but I declined it because it's going to make my tummy sore. And my dad is just like, okay, cool, you're hungry, we'll go buy food. Now I'm where other people are hungry, are hungry, I cook. Like, it's so nice, like, to, to have your, living with kids, especially a teenager and a toddler, will always just make you feel like you're not doing enough. Because we know toddlers, we know teenagers. So being in a space with people who reciprocate your efforts in their own different ways it's, it's very very nice i'm gonna make myself coffee now and then when my dad comes back with my food i'm going to knock off and i'm gonna eat and i'll see yeah i'll see you guys when we eat that's gonna be my dinner no one's cooking today it's gonna be my dinner and then we'll chill with the kids alan needs to probably do her homework so at half past four so what happens is at half past four we swap half past four i pack up and then she comes does her homework and then again knocks us and us but let me leave you guys. I will see you when it's time to have some dinner. Did you guys, is it just me? Or like, did you just always have the urge to quit your job when someone asks you to do your job? It's just me. I'm like a little spoiled brat. Like, when someone 
looks good thanks i guess when someone like asked me to do my job and it's my job like it's i should have done it but i'm always just like i just want to quit I just want to quit <laughs> um look but anyway i am going to see you guys mushrooms and I actually went I went to the shop for coffee um let's make some coffee um Milani just woke up oh oh my mama's my mom's only Milani don't go to oh my mom's off Milani does go to so this entire week entire week I have to deal with Milani so let's make some coffee and let us Get to work. I've got, I think, six back-to-back -back meetings today. Milani. Milani. Because Milani is openly calling my mom by her name. Tenji, where are you? Where well, Milani? Let's get some coffee. Milani, brush your teeth.
never would talk to me then if we never met hey guys my parents are out and they took milani with i think i did mention earlier that when my mom is on leave or when she's off my mom for those who don't know she's a nurse and you know they work shifts so like um so like she'll work like maybe monday tuesday then be off wednesday thursday friday every time my mom is off milani doesn't go to school at all West Camp Man, she's on leave the entire week and Milan is not going to school the entire week. So for me, I'm just like, if Milan is not at school, I'm being disturbed through work, by work. But they are out now and I want to quickly make myself breakfast before they come back so that I don't have to make breakfast for everyone. Or maybe I should just make breakfast for everyone. Shame, let me make breakfast for everyone. I want to make some omelets. Yeah, let me make breakfast for everyone. <laughs> let me make breakfast for everyone let's make breakfast quickly it's 20 to 10 i've got another i've, I've literally have been back to back meeting since 9 a.m luckily this one i just had now lasted 10 10 minutes so i have 20 minutes to prepare breakfast for three people and then i have another meeting at 10. let's make breakfast you don't care what you're doing to me I've been down in the ruins so deep All the games they you play, all the love you've forsaken You let it slip away, oh, 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 oh. You don't care what you're doing to me Every setback, every mishap, every time you say you gon' change Say you get it, you regret it, I forgive it, but you stay the same you should cry an ocean for me For the dumb shit and the damage you've done Cause I've been crying oceans for weeks Try to fight it but I'm drowning alone today i'm going to tell you that much i my salary um it's half past three i just got out of a meeting it was supposed to be till four let's go sit with mama it was supposed to be till four my mom is sitting in her garden it was supposed to be till four it was supposed to be till four, it it was to be till four but we're done i'm just gonna chill with my mom in her garden name the son
magic places in the world I've been to This is where my heart is, oh you know it's true No matter where I go, I'm coming home to you It's in straight from Hawks Garden the street so many times so, okay, Daddy, No every break and stone can wear a blindfold No matter yeah. what I do, I'm Fast. coming home to you oh. And I, I don't know so, so why, guy. why, don't <laughs> why I'm always feeling homesick Okay, I'm gonna go back and work. It's like half past three. I'm gonna go back and work. I'm so tired. I'm gonna go back and work. And then a bit later, then I'm gonna watch my mom cook. And then a bit later, we're gonna go um, go fetch Alwande. She's got some quiz thing at school. Usually she'd be back by now. Yeah, it's half past three. She'd be back by now. But she's got some quiz at school, so we're gonna go fetch her. And they only arrive at school at seven. So when I leave here around quarter to seven, because the school is the school is in Morningside, it's about fifteen minutes away from us. Um, usually she's got transport. Her Misa is going in Landa, but because there's extra mural, extra curricular, what extra murals there, um, she's going to come. We have to obviously we can't expect to Malum to go fetch her. And then I think I'll shut the vlog there. Um, or maybe I'll just chill with my kids a little bit. It's been a while. Also, I was in Joburg and it's just been a while. Yeah, but I'm definitely, after, I'm going to watch my mom cook now. Well, I'm going to finish work, then watch my mom cook. And then go fetch Wawa. And then I'll, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> That's the ghetto. The ghetto, the ghetto, the absolute ghetto. We just went to go, we haven't had water the whole day. So we went to go fetch Alwanda at school. And now we're just like struggling for water. And we got a message to go to the civic hall. We're at the Civic Hall now to get water and when last, when last, we've gotten these two. Thank God my mom has this because I'm not banging corn. But anyway, it's time to put them in the boot and let's go home. So cuddle with my babies. The ghetto, the ghetto. But thank God my mom has these things. You know, when I don't have water in Joburg, I just go by and when you don't have water, go by stress song. It's 
spread. Oh, si you pay, come some of plastic. Baby, when it settles in, that you're to blame. 